Well, good Monday afternoon to you guys. Uh, I was watching the Affordable Housing Board meeting this morning on the uh, Lawrence YouTube page and uh, came across something that I thought I wanted to make everybody aware of. Um, it's very interesting. We, uh, we actually have another person from Johnson County that's been appointed to one of our boards. Pay attention here. Hi, I'm Lee Seung Han, and uh, it's a Korean name. I'm from South Korea. Uh, I am an associate professor in the urban planning department at KU. I joined KU in 2020, right in the middle of pandemic. So just four years, but feels mm -hmm. like shorter. <laughs> <laughs> um, I teach classes in um, housing policy and housing planning. I do research. Um, so my um, area of expertise is um, many of the housing issues that you find mostly in inner city neighborhoods. And I um, evaluate the government interventions or the policies that are designed or that are attempted to address <laughs> these <laughs> issues. <laughs> Okay, now I want to address that right there. She evaluates government policy and she's on an affordable housing board for our city government. Um, I'm curious if she's going to be able to fairly evaluate her own participation in this board, but let's go ahead and continue on here. Now, this isn't about the person. This is about the appointment. I have no knowledge of who this lady is or anything about her. All I know is what you're seeing right here. <laughs> so that's... Um... That's where I do my research. Um, I live in Overland Park, but I work here in Lawrence. Now that's my problem. She lives in Overland Park. Why do we have board members being appointed to our city government boards who live in different areas? Um, some of our departments in this city even have some kind of residential requirements. And I know, I, I believe the the, police and, and uh, sheriff might. I'm not real sure, but I know that there are some residential requirements for people. Um, I'm curious why this person from Overland Park is sitting on this board, regardless of her profession. Friends, um, I think that's all about me, unless you have questions that you want to ask me. No? Okay. Did you teach before you came to KU? Yes, I um, taught for five years at UMKC. Okay. Thank How do you spell your first name? Heesung. How do you spell it? Oh, H-Y-E dash, there's a dash, S-U-N-G. That's the first name, and the last name is short, Han, H-A-N. Got it. Thanks. Thank you. Okay, like I said, it has nothing to do with the person. This has to do with the fact that she lives in another community, and she's appointed to our board. That's uh, that, that's kind of an issue that I think some of our citizens should have some of an issue with because she's invested in another community by her residence. Um, her employment here is is a part time gig in Lawrence at best, and I doubt there's much involvement beyond KU uh, because that's what we've seen in the past. But I question this appointment, and I think it got lost in the whole appointment of Josh Seiden that Amber Sellers tried to pull off to the city uh, community police review board. And, uh, you know, if we miss this one because of that, you know, damn on us. But uh, I think somebody should be questioning this one. Thanks guys for watching. Have a good day.